52 vlogs in 52 weeks for 2017. Um I'm treading slowly on this talking road Just waiting on the sun to rise I'm treading slowly on this talking road Just waiting for another try Open up the sky so I can breathe again Open up my eyes so I can see again Cause ever since you left It's never been the same Am I the only one in the world that has one of these for like two or three weeks before it uh, finally gets taken care of? I'm trying to find a good spot that just they can actually see, but that I'm not losing any. I guess this is the vlog where we kind of talk about uh, goals, uh, what I'm looking to do, why I'm doing this, who I'm doing it for, like those type of things. Because um, I literally, I literally have zero content of writing this week. That's what happens when you live in Yuma, Arizona. Um, I drove from Yuma to Lake Havasu, did the race, um, got 8th place, which is not that good because there's only like 11 riders and two of them had mechanicals. Um, but immediately after I left Lake Havasu, came back to Yuma, uh, packed and then got ready, you know, probably slept like 3 hours, probably max, and then went to Vegas and was in Vegas for a convention for work for Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, and then back to work here in Yuma, uh, Thursday, Friday. So it was, it's really hard to travel with the bike. Um, and the reality of it is, you know, my, my work day started at 5 a.m. and ended close to midnight. So kind of pointless to take a bike to begin with and I was able to get a ride it would probably only be like maybe a 60 minute ride which I do love riding in Vegas uh, there's a lot of great trails out there you have Red Rock that's ridiculously scenic uh, tons of climbing um, and then you have that path and I can't think of the name of it but it goes near Boot Lake Canyon where they have Interbike and it goes you can see the Hoover Dam from it it's, it's also very cool um, if you get a chance uh, I recommend both. Probably Red Rock first. Uh, the other one is all paved. It's a paved path mostly. And so that's really nice. Uh, especially coming from Yuma, Arizona. You just don't, you know, a lot of our riding has to be done in the interstate. So I figure um, this vlog will probably be, you know, why am I doing it? What are my goals? Uh, for 2017, one of my New Year's re resolutions was to learn something new. Uh, I guess you can never, I feel like that you should never stop learning. You should always be challenging yourself, pushing yourself. And so, I get, I'm probably loud in a lot of our group rides, uh, but you put a camera in front of me and I just shut down. I'm super quiet. I don't know what to say, I don't know where to look, um, I just blank out, and I don't know what it is, and, uh, believe it or not, it's, you know, I actually have a fear of being in front of the camera, and so I figure, you know, let's do 52 vlogs in 52 weeks for 2017. Uh, they're mostly going to be about cycling, kind of what I do, it's kind of, um, it's a part of my life. I have a road bike, a mountain bike, and a single speed, which is also a mountain bike. Um, which is funny because I'm probably a better road rider uh, than I am a mountain biker. But again, going and facing your fears, like I know I'm a bad mountain biker, but 
not really letting that slow me down and just kind of continuing to challenge myself. Um, so there might be sometimes, I'll, I actually probably will throw in some stuff that has nothing to do with cycling just because probably nothing but cycling could get boring. Um, like this Vegas trip, that would have been a pretty good, uh, it, you know, at least just B-roll, if nothing, but it is kind of hard. It was a lot of work stuff, so it was kind of hard to fit in. But if it was a vacation in Vegas, you know, then that would have made that would have made for some fun. And I definitely would have been riding since I live so close, and I can take my bikes pretty easily. Uh, that might that might be the end of this vlog. But hopefully this week um, I'll be getting some riding. I missed a ton of riding. Uh, I feel that my legs feel soft, and you know, honestly, after doing so bad after my last races, this is like the the last thing that I should have been doing, but I'll probably be getting some long, just putting putting tons of miles in this week, plus work. So see you guys next week.